This is the most common question I've been asked a lot of times, like how to install custom indicators like belly system, boards and other things on Android MetaTrader. Well, I've got a solution for you. This is the reason why I've decided to make a video for you guys. Okay, so first of all, before we begin, let me just make something clear that uh, the MetaTrader 5 or 4 for Android does not support installation of custom indicators you can only install and apply already available indicators in the app you cannot install indicators like belly system on your android and you cannot install uh bolts or ease and so on so these things are not available and you cannot do them on android but i've got a solution for you of which i use uh to install custom indicators on android so let me just show you some something that will make you see that okay this thing works okay so this is the reef metatrader 5 so as you can see uh, this is metatrader 5 and i'm currently running it on android okay let me just swipe up and see okay as you can see this is my android phone okay but here it is i'm running metatrader metatrader 5 so what are some of the things i can do here Okay, let me just rotate the screen. Okay. So as you can see here, it's more like I'm running Windows in an Android where I've got Chrome, Derive, and so on. Well, unfortunately, this is the only way possible to, to uh, install custom indicators on Metatrader 5. So if I would like to install a custom indicator, I can open up the data folder there and import indicator or add other files I want. So the question you might be having, how possible is this? How am I able to run Windows 10 on my phone? And how am I able to run uh, MetaTrader 5 on my Android phone? As you can see, this is Android, okay? Well, this is simple. I remember I made a video on this, okay? Yeah, I made a video on this of which some of you never really watched. Okay, so how possible is this, okay? So I remember last time I made the video about how to get a free cheap VPS. Okay, so this installation of custom indicators on your Android is only possible when you're using a VPS. So what is a VPS? As I mentioned earlier on my other video, I said the VPS is a private, um, it's a virtual private server. Okay, it's more like a computer which is in another country remotely of which you can rent it out. Okay, the computer Yeah, so and the last thing I need to install is remote desktop client. Okay, so as for me, I prefer the same remote desktop by Microsoft. It's the fastest and easiest to use and it's also free. Okay, but in my previous video, we were using um, TeamViewer. It's okay, you can also use TeamViewer, but in, in my experience, TeamViewer was a bit slow. But remote desktop is much better, much, it's very, very, very fast. Okay, yeah, so you can install a uh, remote desktop. So you first need to go to your Google Play and search for remote desktop. Okay, and install any of those you are seeing there. As for me, I prefer this same one which is as good an 8 at the end. Okay, you can install any of your choice, but I prefer this one. So when you open it, as for me, I already configured mine. So all I need to do is just click on it and it will open up. And as you can see, this is MetaTrader 5. Okay, it's more like I'm running Windows 10 on Android. I'm also running like Chrome. I can also click on the menu bar for Windows there. I can also do any other things I can do on a Windows PC. Okay, of which this one is currently remotely, so I can do anything. Yeah, okay, so uh, this is the video I was talking about on how to get a free VPS. Okay, so in this video, I explained all the necessary steps and the advantages of getting a free VPS for your Forex. Okay, and one of them I mentioned that having a VPS guarantees you of faster executions. Okay, because when you buy a VPS, a VPS is usually located in USA, which is near the broker's server and so on. Yeah, so to then more simply 
watch the video i'll include the link to this video in the description and if you are new to this channel make sure to subscribe so that you keep on receiving this type of videos okay and in my next video i'm going to talk about how to uh, convert metatrader 4 indicators into metatrader 5 and vice versa so you need to keep on being subscribed and feel free to like okay to support me to and also comment if you have any other questions and if you like the video feel free to share it with your friends and i think it's bye bye for now okay